Here goes Martin Ling, scurrying on as well, past the first defender. Here's a chance now for Nicky Somerville, a terrific effort. Somerville has teed up Ling and he's got past Chamberlain as well. Ling looking for somebody to cut it back to. Here comes Somerville and a fine stop by Alan Knight. Ling's ball in. Mitchell really tussling for it here. Still Mitchell there. Somerby, Bowden, yes! It's in this time. Paul Bowden, the scorer. And the fullback, who keeps getting these important goals, has another one for Swindon Town. I think I even had less to do today than I did at, uh, against Tranmere. I think I only had one save against Tranmere. And I've had even less than that to do today. So uh, it makes my job so much easier. I mean, it just shows the amount of work that the, the players in front of me are getting in and uh, all credit to them. We've got it all, we've got, to, we've got to play all the top teams, the rest of the top teams and they've got to come here and they're going to, they're going to worry about us, so we've got everything to look forward to. Looking up the route map to places like Highbury, Anfield and Old Trafford, their 1-0 win over promotion rivals Portsmouth was their fifth in the last six games. They had to wait until two minutes from time to clinch the points. Paul Bowden's goal, his fifth in the last seven games. Astonishingly for the newly prolific Bowden, it was the first for some time with his right foot. But it was the third time in the last month that the fullback had scored the winner. Would. If Swindon sell, it would harm their promotion chances. If they don't, it would harm their fragile bank balance. Last year, Swindon were heading for promotion when they sold their top striker, Duncan Shearer. The bank manager may have been happy, but not the manager or the fans. No offers been made for Calderwood, although rumours of a move have been dismissed as speculation. The club does have a deficit of two and a quarter million pounds, and some directors feel that is the priority. Well, on Saturday, Swindon notched up their fifth win in six games as defender Paul Bowden once again scored the winner to lift Swindon into fourth place.